New this morning, we're just two days away now from the start of early voting in Virginia. Yeah, this year Richmonders will have several opportunities to vote. Brendan King joins us now in the studio. And Brendan, you spoke with the city's registrar. What did you learn about the need for poll workers as well as the upcoming dates voters need to know? Election season seems to never I know, end right? at all, Robin <laughs> Reba. And once again, we're back at it. Richmond Registrar Keith Balmer says he is ready for a busy election season and he also needs your help. Typically, he hires 700 poll workers to work the elections, but listen to this. This year, he needs double that, 1,400 poll workers. One thing that we're going to do here in the city is that our recruitment efforts is geared towards people who live in the same neighborhood where they vote at because if that's the case, then you know you can be you know rest assured that those people are going to be even more engaged to come out and help because they're going to be helping their neighbors vote. Palmer tells me he's been preparing for this 2024 November election since he was sworn in three years ago. Richmond voters will elect a new mayor. Every city council seat, every school board seat will also be up for grabs. That's in addition to this big presidential race. But this Friday, early voting for the Super Tuesday, March 5th presidential primary begins. Virginians will be able to vote in either the Democratic or the Republican primary. So when our poll workers, when they ask the voter what uh, party, they're not asking you to be intrusive. They're asking you because they need to know that you, you know what ballot to give you because there'll be two different ballots to give you. So, um, you know, a lot of voters tend to get like offended by that, but you know, it's a procedural, procedural ne necessity. Once again, early voting at your local registrar's office begins Friday. The last day to vote early is March 2nd, so we certainly do have some time. In our next half hour, I'll tell you how Register Bomber is working to make running for local office easier here in the city. Rob, that's ahead at 630.